Good. Keep it loaded. Keep it loaded. Keep it loaded. Keep it loaded. Bad at night. Looking at the camera. Good, good, good. Preloaders, VI preloaders, welcome back to the channel, guys. Always a pleasure to have you guys here with me, and you know this by now, or at least you should. For those of you that are new to this channel, welcome to you as well. My name's Robert. I'm a retired NYPD Highway Patrol motorcycle lieutenant, and the name of this wonderful channel is Be the Boss of Your Motorcycle. This is my girl, Allure. Allure is my 2023 Harley Davidson breakout, and man, she is just badass, right? That's my opinion. I know it's subjective, but I gotta tell you guys something. When it comes to this motorcycle, either people tell me they regret getting rid of their breakout, or they have one and they love it. So I love this motorcycle too, and I've added quite a few things to it, more to come, and speaking of which, you see the box, guys, so you already know we're going to be changing the seat out on this motorcycle, and I have Saddleman seats on all of my motorcycles. I love the company. I love the seats. I love the gel technology that they provide as far as comfort is concerned. I also like low-profile seats, and that's what the breakout comes with, but we're going to step that up a notch, get something that looks a little bit better, and that's what's in this box. So let me take, about, take it out of the box. I'm not going to take you to a whole unboxing. I'm just going to open up the box, and when I come back, you're just going to see it. All right, guys, so here's the seat. I'll give you a close-up of the orange stitching. And if you're wondering, Robert, orange stitching? Why orange stitching? That's why, right there. So we got the black and the Harley Davidson orange and the seat to match. Oh, man, that's going to look good. Got the Saddleman logo. And of course, I got to choose all of these colors. You can choose the color that you want this to be. I wanted it to be the, uh, the same orange as the stitching. That's just, it's just really nice, really nice. Show you guys a side-by-side -side comparison. And guys, you know, this is the first time I'm probably ever gonna say it. Now keep in mind, I only have 266 miles on my breakout, but that seat, that Harley Davidson seat was not bad at all. It was actually pretty, you know, it was, it was pretty comfortable for the time that I sat on it. Um, but we're going to see what we get out of the saddleman seat. All right, let's get it on the motorcycle. Um, one thing I will point out, and I was kind of nervous about it, was you see this seat right here, the Harley Davidson seat, has two holes there. And those two holes are for these two things right here, right? That's what the seat attaches to the bike. That's how it attaches to the bike. And then I looked at this one and I said, well, this doesn't have it. This actually has that one hook right there. And you see it says remove, rotate, and reattach. And that's usually what I use on my Saddleman seats um, for the other bike. That's how my Road King and my uh, CVO Limited, that's how those seats go on. But that doesn't work for this bike. However, this seat did come with some extras. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be used to accommodate this seat. All right, so we are doing the same thing, guys, as far as this is concerned, as per the instructions. I flipped it around already, retighten these, um, and the bracket that comes with the seat, that's what it looks like. You simply just slide it on, right? It also comes with those two black washers, 4.5 millimeters thick, and then that bracket that's sticking out of the back of the seat, it's gonna go onto here, and then these two nuts, are gonna be used with the washers over them on top of those two screws. And then this is just a finishing screw that's gonna go on that black one right there. All right, let's get it on. All right, guys. So the first thing I'm gonna say, and this is for people that haven't been to this channel before, I don't exaggerate, I don't over embellish, I don't sugarcoat, I don't blow smoke, none of that stuff. So my reaction to this is purely genuine. And my reaction is, OMG. Now my wife came out and looked at it and her words 
pretty much describe it perfectly. She said that this thing leaps off of the motorcycle. Look at that, guys. Oh, my God. I'm not going to go all the way over it yet because I want you to see the seat and the orange stripe on the motorcycle. I mean, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Just look at this thing. I mean, the bike is already sharp, and it's just sharper now. Just look at that, guys. I mean, that is just impressive. I didn't sit on it yet. <laughs> I will. But first, I just want you guys to look at this. Woo, wee, that is, that, I mean, that just, that is sharp. That is sharp. And the other thing that I like, guys, is, so with the other seat, it comes with a pillion. When you take the pillion off, if you just want a solo seat, now you see those two, there was two silver uh, screws to hold the seat on. That didn't look great. So now, the only thing sticking out is this, and at least it's black, just like the fender. So just very, very nicely done. Very nicely done. All right, guys, I'm going to sit on it, see how it feels. And, of course, the seat has to be broken in. It's got gel technology in it. Um, but just the aesthetics of the seat, I am very, very pleased. All right, let's see how this seat feels. So it feels good, and also I like the fact that it comes up on the back to give me a little support. Because I, I, listen, guys, with this 117s, you know, uh, you hit this throttle, and <laughs> if this seat doesn't have a little support to hold you on, and you're not holding on tight, yeah, this thing could throw you. But all right, now of course I'm gonna have to ride the motorcycle for a while, break this seat in so that gel technology is doing what it's supposed to do. But right now, it feels good. And I got to tell you guys, you know, even if this seat didn't feel great, it wasn't going anywhere because it just looks beautiful. And I, I, I often say that this breakout, um, I treat this breakout like a woman in her shoes. And with a woman in her shoes, comfort comes second. How, it, how they look on her come first. And that's pretty much how the breakout is as far as I'm concerned. It's not all about how comfortable the bike is. It's how good it looks. And I mean, this, this Saddleman seat has just escalated it. Um, even more so upward in the good looks department. It's just a sexy, sexy looking bike. And Saddleman just brought that all together. So I want to thank Saddleman for providing this seat uh, for Allure. She just, it's just a beautiful seat. It looks great. Listen, guys, if you're interested in a Saddleman seat, I'm telling you now, right? There's a bunch of choices for you to choose from. Go to Saddleman.com. I'll put a link in the description section uh, for it as well. And I'm guaranteeing you, you're going to find something for your motorcycle that you're going to like. And the fact that you can choose the stitching, um, the logo, as far as the color and all of that stuff, you can get something that's going to really match your bike rather than just a plain Jane O seat with plain Jane O stitching. Right, guys? Good to have options. Check out the website. Plenty to choose from and good customer service. You guys know how I feel about that. Good customer service is, uh, is, a, is running a close first. I'm not even going to say a close second, but a close first. To the quality of the product and these seats are all quality um if you put them against any stock seat stock seat I've, I've, I've showed in the video where i can actually bend the seat that came on my road king versus the san diego custom seat that i have on there now and that thing wasn't going nowhere it's just a solid solid seat rubber on the underside to protect the motorcycle just good stuff all right guys all right that's gonna do it for me guys spend more time being thankful for the things that you have and less time complaining about the things that you don't Seat time doesn't equal practice time, guys. And if you have time to ride your motorcycles, please make time to practice on them and adorn them with a Saddleman seat so it will look that much better, right? Or if you're practicing, you'll look that much better as you're practicing on it. And I can guarantee you guys, when I get off of this motorcycle and I park it somewhere, it already is an eye catcher. With this addition of this Saddleman seat, even more so, and that's beautiful for me. Till next time, guys.